We've got some new stuff, candy cane and curlies and peach. The jingle bells, which is the red and pink flex. Yellow, which is called lemon drop. V14, glory. Uh, Lilo red, freedom red. But really, 75% of our business is still red. Well, we've been here since 1923. You know, my dad and I both went to San Diego High School along with my sisters, and uh, it it does feel pretty good. We we've, we've all grown up here, and, and we all most of us still live here. We feel a lot of responsibility to to uh, the world because if we do something to uh, uh, cause a problem with our poinsettia mother plants, no Christmas. What do you do with the plants? Talk to them. Why? When I water them. They're good for them. Do they ever talk back? They've said a few things back. Why? No, I don't know. <laughs> but it helps them. Yeah, I think so. so That's how we, play, we usually play Christmas music too. That helps them too. Euphorbia pulcherima. The biological name for the vivid red and green Christmas plant, the poinsettia. Maybe you heard somewhere that poinsettias are poisonous. That myth has been around for as long as I can remember. And, uh, as sure as there is a Christmas each year, there is the myth of the poisonous poinsettia for growers to deal with. As best as anyone can tell, it started in the 1950s with the death of a baby which apparently ate a poinsettia leaf. They never did any tests. They never, you know, maybe it choked. Maybe it uh, died from some of the pesticides they were using. Maybe it was something totally different. But growers have spent a bundle having them tested and say poinsettias are totally non-toxic and safe. Poinsettias are jungle plants native to Mexico. They got their name from the U.S. ambassador who introduced them to the state. The poinsettia came from uh, a guy named Joel Robert Poinsett, who was our first ambassador to Mexico back in 1825. Out west, the plants have always been known as poinsettia, which does sound a bit affectated. Back east, they say, yo, get me a poinsettia, dropping the I-A ending for an A only. Either pronunciation is acceptable. Both are used interchangeably, and what we always say is we certainly don't care what you call it as long as you buy one. Before I go, one more poinsettia point. They're grown in many places, Florida and even New York. But 90% of the cuttings needed to grow them come from the famous Eki Ranch in Encinitas. Doug McAllister, News 8.